Another thing that happened in ancient Lemuria were big choirs with hundreds of people, and they sang tones in pairs, creating overtones and harmonics. Another thing that's happening here is the Aloha Choir, the 12th choir in 12 years, and 12, 12, 24, to create a vibrational energy pattern to support rejuvenation, but also expanded consciousness. And we anticipate this event being so powerful that two different groups, the Global Coherence Project, is going to be measuring with thousands of sensors all around the world whether we change the coherence of the entire planet wow. from the fire. Wow. Well, we should all anticipate perhaps getting a bit of spring in our step. <laughs> 12, 12, 24. What we're singing now, you described as shockingly accurately recreating what was done in the ancient Lemurian choirs and that it was possible to rejuvenate the body and not age simply by using the tones as they were done in those times. Now you don't have to sell me on this because when I had my near-death experience in 2012, which people have been pleading for me to talk about, and I've been nervous because it's very out there, it's very sci-fi, <laughs> it's very sci-fi, I mean my body disappeared and I saw a different environment that looked like a, la a lattice grid of energy balls. Mm. And John Stuart Reed, the sound scientist, he said he felt I had seen the very fabric of space and time. And the information that came to me, which was a lot, but one of the things was that sound can heal anything and that music is the key. So it's very interesting that you and I unexpectedly should cross paths. Mm -hmm. And this is exactly what you are doing. You're involved in sound, healing, and music literally being the key to potentially change the frequency of the entire planet this coming Thursday, 12, 12, 24. And speaking of John, he has made his Slimoscope technology portable. And for the first time in history, the choir is going to see the geometries, the sound wave patterns of their voices are creating in real time. Incredible. By the way, he's a friend of mine. John is a friend of mine. I have been to the science lab. So have you been to the science. We're both, we're both friends. <laughs> <laughs> we are both friends of John. <laughs> he has way more fancy science friends than me though. <laughs> well, thank you so much, uh, sir, Dr. Todd. This is um, really remarkable what you're doing. Uh, it, it really is not just life-changing for individuals, but it is potentially world-changing. All of you out there who've been waiting and talking about is the frequency and vibration of the planet going up. This man is a core figure in those activities. So thank you so much for your time. Great pleasure, thank you. <laughs>